Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see by the title, today's video is going to be a Shein fall, I guess you could say pre-fall. I mean, it's damn near fall. It's like probably like a week or two until it's actually fall. But this is going to be a fall try on haul. I have so many pieces. So you guys know how I do. I start with shoes and accessories and then I move on to the tops, bottoms, jackets, sets, dresses, whatever. And I'm gonna have the video in chapters. So I will have the chapters in the description box and in the comments if you guys are looking for a specific section and yeah let's get right into it so i have quite a few bags this is not all of them i actually have a few more on the ground but the very first one is this teal blue shoulder bag and i've really been loving these because they literally go with anything they have so many colors on shein so if you're looking for a specific bag or a specific color definitely check out this bag because they have a bunch of different colors and they're just super cute to throw on your shoulder hence the name their shoulder bags and they're just really cute and they actually have a decent amount of space in them as well so you can definitely fit a good amount of stuff in here so i really really like this bag so next up we have this dumpling style bag and Shein is killing it with these okay they have so many different styles of these bags this one is a denim style as you can see it does have a gold chain strap and it's super duper cute. You can hold it like a shoulder bag like this, or you could carry it and have the chain just hanging like that for a really cute look. This I got because I really like the denim look. I think this will look really cute with like an all denim look. If you could find the right shade of denim to go with this, I think it will be such a look and then have all like gold accessories. It'd be a look, okay? So I really, really like this bag. So next up we have a very similar style bag. And this one is just a brown, I believe it's croc. I believe this is crocodile. And it literally is just embossed. And it's brown and it has the same exact strap as the other one. And this one is just really, really nice. I'll have the photos up of these bags, but I really, really like this a lot. I love the brown and the gold contrast. It looks really, really good together. And I hope the lighting, the lighting is just doing something right now. I don't know what's going on. I look like a freaking Oompa Loompa and everything else looks super vibrant so please excuse that i'll try to fix it but this bag is super super nice i really like this one so next up is this super adorable bandana bag and shein okay they have been killing it with these little bandana bags i love these so much because i have actually been looking for a very specific which i'll show you guys up next a very specific bag to go with this top that i have and when i saw this bag not this one but when i saw that they had these bandana bags i was like yes okay so this is the bag or the first one and as you can see it has a little chain strap and it's just really cute and small and such a look like you can literally add this as like a pop of color or an accent to an outfit if you were like all black or black and white this would be such a cute little bag to carry with it so i really really like these and they do have other colors as well so this is the bag that i was talking about i have a very specific top and honestly i didn't know that i was going to find a bag to go with that top i just kind of held on to the top i was actually going to end up selling it on poshmark but i kept it because i was like i'm gonna wear this one day and then i found this i'll show you guys this top in a second i've shown it in a previous haul so some of you guys may already know what i'm talking about but this goes perfectly okay with that top and i'm just so excited to rock it okay so don't steal my idea do not steal my idea because if i see you wearing it I'm gonna know that you watched this video okay or at least tag me okay at least tag your girl but anywho this is that bag and I'll show you guys the top in a second so this bag I have worn in style before I love this it's like a little ruched detail on it I don't know if y'all can see that but they do have other colors in this as well and I really like this one it's super duper cute so girly and fun and I'll insert any pictures of any of the items that I've styled in today's video so you guys can see but I really like this one a lot a lot of people really like this bag and they were asking where I got it from it is from Shein of course so yeah this is the next bag so here we have a orange bag which matches my face at this point and I really like this one a lot I don't have any orange bags so I've really been trying to find the perfect orange bag this isn't there yet this isn't necessarily spot on because this is kind of more of a vibrant orange i want like a true orange i don't know if that makes any sense but this is super cute though it does have like a little knot detail right there so it's a cute little bag it has a decent amount of space in it and it also has like these magnetic closures i don't know if you guys heard that but they just snap together 
with magnets so there's no like zipper or anything but yeah this one's super cute so this bag i got for a very specific reason but i don't need it anymore for that specific reason so right now this bag is just looking a little childish if you ask me um this looks like something a early teen preteen a little girl would wear as a purse um it's cute but what i needed it for i no longer need it for so i think that's kind of why i'm just like eh about it but whatever it's like silver at the top silver at the bottom like yeah y'all already know this this ain't my style okay this ain't but when you're looking for something very specific sometimes you got to kind of bend your rules a little bit but this no nah. so this bag i actually did style on my instagram and i really love this bag you guys so freaking cute anytime i see something with like straw detailing on it i always gravitate to it because of my platform straw heels that you guys saw in that picture i got those years ago and i just love them so much like they are dangerous okay dangerous be careful okay be careful when you're wearing those but they have such a unique look to them and when i find things like this that have that material on it i just fall in love so this was super cute the outfit that i paired with it was like very chill but very girly and just I loved it. I loved it. I'll insert the picture. But yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite bags. I love the gold hardware. I love the chain. I love the extra strap. I love it. Okay. So next up we have this tote and Shein has been killing the tote game. Okay. They have been killing it and I need every single color. So this is really cute. I love this whole vibe and I actually did style this. I hope by the time you guys see this video, you will have seen that photo. I'll probably end up posting it on the same day, honestly. This bag, I styled this bag so chill, but it's definitely one of my favorite outfits ever because it's so chill and it's so me. So you guys will see, I'll put the picture up if I have posted it already. If I haven't, follow me on Instagram so you guys can see the fit because it's, it's lit, okay, it's bomb. But yeah, this is really cute. I love this tote, I love the vibes, I love the colors, I love everything about it, so yeah love this so the very last bag that i have here is this beauty right here and i have had my eye on her for a little while okay and she is gorgeous this color this design just everything about this is gorgeous you guys this bag is gorgeous and it's a really nice size as well i do wish it was a little bit bigger i thought it was gonna be like a tote tote like really big but it's not it's not that small but it's not as big as i'd like it to be and it's a little flat because it's nothing in it but this is so freaking gorgeous i cannot wait to style this you guys like i can't wait to rock this bag like this is one of my favorites in a very long time okay a very very long time so yeah definitely check this out if you guys like this bag if you like totes this is it so i do have one two three four pairs of shoes and then we're going to move on to the clothing portion which is going to be voiceover edition because it's so much stuff that this video will literally be like an hour long if i tried everything on and talked about it and all that you guys already know the drill i know you guys probably wouldn't mind an hour video but i do not want to edit that so it's going to be voiceover but i do have some shoes to show you guys before we move on to that and first up are these right here so like i showed you guys that bag earlier with the straw the shoes that i had on in that picture i got years ago so they're no longer available but i found these dupes basically that are very very similar if not damn near the same as those except for these are a little bit more on the dangerous side i really do wish that they would not have made the sole of this like faux leather basically so your feet are going to be sliding around especially if it's a hot day and your feet are sweating or something or your foot gets wet or whatever you're going to be sliding around in these and these shoes are already quite dangerous to walk in i have literally almost broken my ankle like 10 times wearing the ones that i have the sole on there is very it's like a matte material so that it kind of grips onto your foot this is like faux leather like i said you're going to be sliding around honestly truly i'm just concerned for your safety at this point i really wish they wouldn't have made this this kind of material but that's just me that's just me i'm just letting y'all know but yeah these are basically a dupe for those shoes in this photo right here the shoes from that photo are from public desire but like i said i got them years ago these are the closest thing that i found to those so if you do want to try these out i would but just be careful or maybe get like a different type of sole to wear underneath it i don't know 
but I'm just letting y'all know. Be careful. So next up we have these beauties right here, and these are some green heels, and they have like almost this like puffer coat type of material on it. It's very, very comfortable, very comfortable. And the heel on here isn't super high either, as you can see, very comfortable heel. These are some badass shoes, okay? These are bomb. I love these shoes so much. These are like grown woman, like high fashion, editorial, okay? These are giving me very much high fashion and I love them so much. I wanted to wear these with this bag, but it's not the same green and I'm so sad because this would have been such a look, but don't worry, okay? Y'all know I'm the matching queen, so I'm gonna find something to wear with these shoes and this bag, hell. I'm gonna find something to wear with this, okay? Because these, I have to I have to step out, I have to pop out in these. I have to really do it up with these shoes because these are so nice. And they probably look crazy, but I'll try them on so you guys can see. But these are some bomb. Okay, so next up we have these heels. And these are honestly one of my favorite, my new favorite pairs of heels. These are so sexy, okay? These are like date night. If date night was a shoe, this is it. These are so sexy. As you can see, they are square toe and they do have like a rose gold, as you can see, to it. And then it does have these clear straps on it and then it has a sling back strap right here on the back. And these are just so sexy. They fit so good and they're very, very comfortable as well. The heel is mm, probably like four inches, four and a half, something like that but they're actually very, very comfortable and it does have the Amina style heel on the bottom. And these are just, these are so nice. So, so nice, like perfect for date night. Or if you have like a formal event, these are perfect as well because they're very comfortable and they're very, I feel very secure in these. Like the sling back is very snug. It's not flapping everywhere. Like it feels very, very comfortable. So I really love these a lot. So the very last pair of shoes we have are these sandals. And these are a pair of my favorite sandals and I have not worn them yet. And I don't know if I will, honestly, because I mean, it's still hot. It's still hot as hell here in Texas, but I don't know. I really like these though. They are so cute. They're white and they have a square toe, as you can see. And then they have like this floral scarf print right here as the straps. And you can like tie them up around your ankles or around your jeans or whatever it is you're wearing. And they have a very comfortable stretch to them so they just feel really really good like they feel very comfortable and i really like these a lot i have been trying to find something to wear with these for a long time like the perfect summer fit but we're kind of getting out of that so i don't know if i'm gonna be able to wear these this summer but we'll see i still really like these though they're so freaking cute these are like these are my favorite sandals okay these are so cute to me and I love the square toe. It's just a look. Okay, these are really, really nice. All right, so that is it for these shoes and the bags portion. So now we're gonna move on to the tops, the bottoms, the sets, the jackets, the bottoms, already said bottoms, y'all already, y'all get it, okay? I'm moving on to the clothing. I will have the chapters down below. So if you are looking for a specific chapter, definitely check down below and I will have all of the links listed in the description box in the order that it was shown in the video. In the order that it was shown in the video, okay? I got y'all because it's a lot of stuff and it's a lot going on. So I want to make sure it's very, very organized and easy to follow. So with that being said, let's move on to the clothing. Okay, so first up we have this burgundy button down that has this asymmetrical cut in the front. And this I got because I just really like the color. I'm not a huge fan of how it fits. I did get a size large and I probably should have got a medium if I wanted it to fit a little bit more like the model. This is just a little bit too big around the waist area for me and it's not really giving me that structured look like in the picture. So I definitely should have got a medium, but I do really like the top. I like the I like the concept of the top. It's nice, it's different, and definitely will look a lot better if I ironed it. But this one's really, really cute. Like I said, I got it in a large, should have got a medium, but I still really do like this top a lot. So next up we have a top that is quite similar but obviously it's just a raw edge at the bottom and this i also got in a size large because i didn't want it to be super duper cropped 
And honestly, if you do, if I raise my arms up, sis, it's over. So this one is not for the people who don't want possible under boobs. So if you want it to fit like it does in this clip and you want it to actually cover, I would size up because it is very, 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 very cropped. So you want to be careful with that if you're not into that. In the back, it is a little bit longer, which I like. I do wish it was a tad bit longer in the front just for security purposes, but I still really like it a lot and it's cute. Like I said, I got in a large and then it just has a little text on the left side. And yeah, something really simple, easy to style. Probably won't wear this because it's super cropped, but it's still really cute. So next up we have this tie-dye, orange tie-dye crop top. And as you can see, it is not exactly the same color as the photo. I don't know if that's just my lighting, but in the photo, it definitely looks a bit more deep. And in person, it looks like a typical like orange, if that makes any sense. I got this in a size small and I'm not really sure why I got this. I just thought it was a cute little crop tank, but more than likely I'll just wear it with some jeans like this, or you can rock it with some leggings, do a really chill fit. Nothing major, just thought it was a cute little tank top to have. So yeah, this one I really like a lot as well. So next up we have this mesh crop top and it has all these little, I don't know if these are like dolls. I don't really know, honestly, but I just thought it was cute. I like the color concept. Very, very cute. Definitely would rock this very simple because it is like a statement piece. Maybe just some high-waisted jeans like I have on in the trial portion or maybe even some blue mom jeans would look a little good or look a little better with this. This I got in a size small because it is mesh. So typically mesh fits very, very stretchy. So I always get my mesh tops in a size small. And you guys are gonna see me dancing, of course. But this is just a close up of the top so you guys can see. So yeah. So next up we have this graphic tee and I've been seeing this everywhere and I really like it except for the material. I'm not a huge fan of that shiny spandexy material when it comes to my tees. I want it to be like t-shirt material. So I do like the design, I like the colors, I like everything about it, but I do not like the material. This I got in a size medium because it is an oversized tee. And as you can see, it fits me pretty baggy, pretty oversized. So if you do want it to fit normal, I guess you could say, I would size down. I got a size medium, like I said, cause I didn't want it to be super small. I like my graphic tees to be a little oversized, but I also didn't want to get a large cause I didn't want it to be like a freaking dress. So. I like it, like I said, but I just do not care for this material. So next up we have this super cute cropped sweater. And as you can see, it does have drawstrings. So you can cinch it in at the waist, which I love. I think it just looks so cute like this. And this I got in a size large because I wanted it to be the biggest fit that I could get. And as you can see, it fits. It's not like oversized. It's like a true, I guess, large. I'm not really sure, honestly. It it just looks good to me. It's not like super baggy and oversized. It's like the perfect fit for me. So here I'm just showing you guys the drawstring. You can do it on both sides. You could tie it up to make it secure because I did notice when I would like move, it would kind of loosen up a little bit. So you can like tie it in a bow to tighten it up a little bit. But as you can see, this looks really cute with like some high-waisted jeans. I would definitely rock this with some sweats because that's what this top is giving me. That's the vibes. Okay, that's the vibes it's giving me. So I would definitely rock this with sweats or leggings. This is like one of my favorites for sure because it's me. I love tops like this. So next up we have this really cute patchwork style top and I've been loving these. I love the whole patchwork trend. I love the whole look of it. I love these colors in this top. This top I got a size medium and the sleeves are a bit short and I always have that problem when it comes to long sleeves on Shein. I don't even have long arms, honestly. I don't know why they're always so short on me, but I really do like this top a lot. So, so cute. Definitely a very, very cropped top. So if you aren't into that, this isn't, you know, mm -mm, your cup of tea. This you may not or may be able to wear a bra. I don't have on a bra and this I have on some nipple covers because I feel like you would see the bra underneath in the front. So I would definitely just, you know, keep that in mind. This is a close up of the top. And as you can see, this is like, this is real cute. I like this. 
So yeah, as you can see, it looks really nice with some mom jeans. Um, I'd probably honestly just rock it somewhat similar to this because I would keep it very simple with this top because there's kind of a lot going on up there. So yeah. So next up we have this green top and I'm sure you guys have seen these style tops all over the place. As you can see, once again, the sleeves are just a little bit too short for me personally. I want mine to basically cover like mm, the middle of my hand or at least go down to the middle of my hand and this is like barely touching my wrist so I don't really like that but this top I got in a size medium and I really love the color of it and I like the the cuts and the slits and stuff like that but like I said it's just not long enough in the sleeve department for me but this is really cute I have these shoes that I got from Shein that I was gonna wear with this top but the, the green is kind of off a little bit so I don't know if I'm going to but I do really like this top a lot I just wish the sleeves were like two inches longer honestly but yeah love this top though it's super duper cute with these jeans so yeah let's move on girl let's move on so next up we have this button down and this is one of my favorites in this entire video I actually see my girl Kayla cake rocking this and she makes me want to buy everything that she wears at this point because I had to have this shirt I love it I love the material this is like a very very good quality top like good quality like this is something you would get at a store and pay a decent price for because of the quality I love this top I got it in size large because I wanted a very oversized fit you guys know how I do so with this you can do it so many different ways you can wear it like this buttoned up you could obviously tuck in one side tuck in both you could tie it up in the front you could wear it off the shoulder you could do a whole lot that's why I get a large so I could do a lot with the top and I just this is honestly one of my favorites in this video because it's it's gorgeous I love it it's so nice the quality is everything and it's just my vibe I love these types of tops with jeans you could wear some really nice dress pants you could do like a real chic street look with some sneakers or you can dress it up and wear some heels so these tops are a must for me okay a must if you've never gotten one I would definitely try out this one because this one is bomb okay now this next top honey okay this is gorgeous I love these types of tops I actually have one but I never wore it I had it I've had it for like a year and I've never gotten the chance to wear it but this one I had to get because it's gorgeous and right here in the try on portion I'm basically saying that I wish there was another button because if I don't have it buttoned, then you could see everything up underneath, like my bra and everything. So I do wish it had another button, but I got this in a large and I definitely should have got a medium because it's a little bit too big for me. So if I wanted to wear it buttoned up like this, I feel like it just looks a little bit too big. Like if I were to let go of the middle of the shirt that I'm holding onto, it would just look slouchy and I wanted it to be a little bit more fitted so honestly I could just get it taken in a little bit I'm not sure but as you can see on the sleeves it does have the like lace up which you guys know I love I love in the jeans I love in my heels and I love it on this top so this right here is a vibe I like it with these jeans too I love this top you guys so nice and really close up it does have some pinstripes on it and this is just a whole vibe okay this is like grown and sexy boo okay so next up we just have a basic crop and this is like a I guess you could say like a, a half a moon I don't really know what it's called but the hem of it is like curved so it just looks really really it's not super basic like it's a basic but it adds a little bit of character to it so this I got in a size small and it's just a simple crop um, I just like to get these in the fall because I love to layer so this would be perfect underneath a cardigan underneath a button down underneath a jacket a coat anything child okay this is just a simple basic that is very much needed but it has a little bit of oomph with the curve there so that's why I picked it out but nothing special here so we're just gonna move on to the next piece so next up we have a T and this is actually from the men's section I got this because I had a pair of shoes that I needed this very specific blue for and I'm actually probably not going to end up wearing this top with those shoes because it's not really the vibe I was going for this is too relaxed and it's a pair of heels so I wanted it to be more of a dressy vibe but I just really like this top I got it in a men's medium 
and it fits really cute as you can see I'm doing my favorite thing and just tying it up in the front to give it a little bit more shape so yeah nothing special here so we're gonna move on to the next piece so next up you guys this is one of my favorites I love this freaking sweater I cannot wait till it gets cold enough for me to wear it girl this is so sexy like this is a sexy sweater to me okay sweaters are usually like covered up cozy you know bundling up and very conservative but this is giving me like sexy sweater and it's obviously because it's super cropped which obviously you need to be very very careful almost had a slip in this video sis but um yeah this is a very cropped under boob type sweater so you definitely want to be careful with this one um i really love it though i got it in a size large because i knew it was going to be super cropped and i didn't want any you know i didn't want no problems so i really like this a lot and on the sleeves as you can see it has this like little i don't even know like furry detail i don't know but it's super cute this one is definitely one of my favorites and i cannot wait until it gets cold enough for me to rock it all right so next up we have this really cute very unique cut top and the picture and the actual top the color is just not not even the same i don't even know what that's about but this top is a vibe i love it I love the back of this top. It looks so good. You guys, this I got in a size medium and the back of this shirt is what sold me because it just looks so good. I need to do some back workouts to get rid of these back rolls because sis, I need to rock this top and have a sexy back, okay? No Justin Timberlake, okay? I love this top so freaking much. Definitely check this one out. They do have other colors as well, but this one I thought was the prettiest color. So next up we have a pair of jeans and you guys know I'm like a pro at Shein jeans now so I just know my sizes. These I got in a size medium and I just thought they were really cute. I like the, you can always tell when the waist is going to be snatched so I always gravitate towards those jeans. So this is what they look like. They're, they are folded up at the bottom but you can unfold them. They're a little bit too short for me after I unfold them so I just left them like this because they actually look cute. And these I really like a lot. They have no stretch, but I do think they are true to size because I got a medium and they fit me perfectly. So here's another pair. It literally is damn near the exact same, but these are more of like an acid wash. These I also got in a size medium because they're literally the same jeans. So I got the same size and these I really like. Um, they're okay I mean I don't really have much to say about them I like the other ones better because I like the wash I don't really wear acid wash like that because I never know what to freaking wear with it but I do really like them they do fit exactly the same as the other ones so there's nothing wrong in that department but I just don't know what I would actually wear with these necessarily so next up are a pair of joggers um, these are a little different that's why I got them they kind of reminded me of something that I've seen on Off-White, so that's why I got them because I felt like they were unique and different and not something I normally get. These I got in a size small and they fit really well actually. They're very, very, very high-waisted as you can see and they do have a drawstring that actually works. So if it was a little too loose, you can definitely tighten it. They also have, um, what's the word, drawstrings at the ankles so you can cinch it in i really like these pants but this would be a task for me to style because this is very different and i don't have anything with these colors so let me know down below if you guys would rock these because i don't know so next up i got these very interesting green i guess this is like a sea green i don't really know exactly the the name for this but i thought that they were really cute and i have a top that i'm going to show you next even though we're kind of going in out of order a little bit but I just wanted to show you guys it all together these pants I got in a size medium and I'm not really sure I don't know you guys will see the top that I got to rock with this because it matches perfectly but yeah that's really the only reason why I got these because I thought they went perfectly with the top that I'm gonna show you next which will be in like two seconds so here's the top as you can see it's literally the exact same color as the pants and this goes literally perfectly together I love the hint of purple in this top I did get it in a size large and it fits really nicely not too baggy also not too small because y'all know I like mine to be quite oversized and this is actually just a really cute simple look I would actually rock it just like this and call it a day okay I really like this a lot and I'm gonna be stocking up on my 
flannels because y'all know I love my flannels for the fall. So this one is number one and I have like a million more to go, okay? So next up we have these super cute pants and I really love the colors in these pants. By the way, this top is from Shein, but it's not a part of this video. I know someone's gonna ask, this top is also from Shein. But these pants I got in a size medium and they do have an elastic waist, so they're very, very comfortable. And I love striped pants because they make you look thick, okay? Sis, they making me look a little thick. And sis ain't thick no more. Sis is super small and super slim. I ain't got no booty no more. So these pants are doing it for me, okay? Giving me all the curves, okay? I love it. These, I really, really just love the colors. These are like fall pants, okay? This is a vibe. This will be cute with a crop denim jacket too as well. And a cute little bag. Girl, a look, okay? Such a look. So next up we just have a pair of joggers, or not joggers, sweatpants. And these are just a really, really cute like nude camel color. And these I got in a size medium and you guys know this time of year is it for me. I love the fall, so I just love to have sweats and just very comfortable like hoodies, button downs, plaid flannels and stuff like that to do real chill fits. And these are just perfect. Very, very comfortable, very soft, very stretchy. I love these sweats so, so much. I also got them in another color as well because I wanted to have some like earthy tone in my wardrobe because I don't really have much of it. And these are the other ones. These are brown, as you can see. And these are such a vibe too. I just threw on my Yeezy slides because it gives it gives that, okay? That's what it's giving. Um, I did break my toenail, so don't mind the Band-Aid, sis. But these I also got in a medium. So these are actually from the men's section. And these are some camo joggers. And I just like to go in the men's section sometimes and just kind of browse a little bit. And I just thought these were really nice. I like the wash of this camo. Some camo will be looking real cheesy and cheap. And these just gave me what I wanted. These I got in a size medium and these don't have any stretch at all because they are men's. So they're, they're pretty stuck in their ways. But I got a size medium and I think they fit really well. They also have a drawstring that works so you can cinch in the waist. So next up we have another pair of sweats and these are so cute to me. I love this color scheme. I love it. These are in a size medium and these are some tie-dye sweats. Super comfortable. I love these so much. Such a vibe. I would definitely just rock them very simple like this in the trial portion. Or you can wear some slides. Girl, you can wear anything. These are very, very comfortable. Okay, Shein did that with these sweats. I'm feeling it. I'm here for it. I love them. Okay, so next up we have a pair of my favorite pants in this entire video and these are some really really cute basically leggings or like jogger leggings. I can't really explain it but these I got in a size small and they're super stretchy. Oh my gosh, I styled these. I posted this photo on my Instagram today so go over there and like her. This is such a vibe, okay? I love this whole outfit. I love the whole color scheme. I just love this. And next up, I'm going to show you guys the cardigan that I paired with this outfit. Even though it's not the bottoms, but I just wanted to show you guys all together. So this is the cardigan. And this I got in a size large. And this, you guys know, I am like the queen, okay, of oversized long line cardigans. I just love them so much. And this one is a new baby in my collection. I believe I already said it, but I got this in a large. And I just love this whole vibe the bag in this photo you guys obviously seen this in the beginning of the video but if you didn't look at the accessories part this bag is in the beginning of the video just so you know so next up we have this really cute off the shoulder sweatshirt and these joggers it's a set so it comes together this I got in a size medium and this is such a cute outfit honestly the sweatpants are just a little bit too long for your girl but I do like them I wish they were a little bit shorter because it just looks kind of bunched up at the bottom not really feeling it but i do really like this outfit a lot such a cute look i love the drawstring underneath the sweatshirt because you can cinch it in and it gives that really cute baggy comfy look if that makes any sense so this is what it looks like up close love this so much definitely a fave but like i said i wish the sweatpants were a little bit a little bit shorter 
So next up we have this really cute two-piece set and it's a cropped sweatshirt with this really cute skirt. It's like the typical, if you guys have ever taken a sweatshirt and chopped off the bottom and made a skirt, that's literally what this is. This I got in a size medium and I really like this a lot. I really just love the color. That's what I was drawn to when I first saw this and it's just a vibe. It's super cute. It will look really cute with some sneakers. I'll probably just end up wearing sneakers with this because that's, you know, me, but you could definitely wear heels or sandals or slides, whatever girl. But this is super duper cute. I love it. So next up, I'm giving you badass. I'm giving you motorcycle girl. I'm giving you the girlfriend of the badass dude who drives a motorcycle down the street. I don't really know. But this is such a cute outfit. But the skirt is just not flattering on me personally. So the jacket, I got a size large. And then the skirt, I got a medium. So this is such a vibe, okay? I really, really like this, but it's not fitting me how I want it to necessarily. I feel like if you was a little bit, you know, slim thicker, this would look A1, but for me, it's just not filling me in like I want it to. So yeah. So next up we have this two-piece set and this jacket. So I paired it together because it's literally exactly how the model paired it. And sorry that you can see my freaking bra, but this two-piece set is in a size small and this coat is in a size large and i really just like the vibes it's giving me very much kim kardashian yeezy vibes so i really really like this a lot love the colors i love i just love it i don't know what shoes i would wear necessarily but i really do like the vibes of this outfit so next up we have this really cute set and this actually didn't even come together I found these two pieces like completely separate on the website, but I noticed that they actually match. So I thought it'd be cute together. This really nice button down, which I got in a large and the skirt to match, which I got in a medium. And it's a cute little vibe. The skirt is a little tight around the hips area, but it still fits really nice. It'll definitely loosen up as you wear it. But as you can see, the top is very, very, it's not super oversized, but it's definitely damn near the length of the skirt. So I really, really like this a lot. And for me personally with this, if you want to see the skirt, I would tie it up in the front so it can give like chill but girly vibes at the same time. I really like this color. I love this material. This is kind of similar to the button down in the beginning, the blue one. And I just really like it. It's cute. And I'm just tucking in the back so it gives more of a scrunched up look. And now it's it's a look, okay? It's even more of a look because it's fitted and it looks very feminine. So I really like this a lot. So next up we have this really cute fall, very, very fall themed corduroy button down. And this is such a look. I love these colors so much. I do wish it was a little bit bigger. So that's my only pet peeve. And it's kind of making me not like it because I wish it was like super oversized. This would be such a look. But I got it in a large and this is how it fits. So kind of bummed about that, but I do really love the colorway. I love, this is like a fall day. This is what a fall day looks like, honestly and truly. This is so cute. And obviously I would tie it up in the front to give it a little bit more shape, but I really like this top. But like I said, I wish it was, honestly, I wish it was two times bigger than it is, but yeah. So next up we have a hoodie and this is just a plain brown hoodie and I love how happy the model looks in that photo to put the hood on but this is super cute. I got this in a medium and it's not my favorite material. I'm gonna need Shein to work on the material they use for like hoodies and sweats. I need it to be heavier. I need that okay. I need that but other than that I do like the hoodie. It's cute. It's simple. Nothing major. It's very, very lightweight. So if you like that, then this is perfect for you. But if you want something that's a little bit heavier and warmer, this isn't that hoodie, sis, okay? So next up is one of my favorite pieces in this video. And this is most definitely, I would say my, my number one because I love this color. I'm definitely gonna rock this with my creepers. You guys already know I'm bringing the creepers back out because I don't know, I miss them. I don't see people wearing them anymore and I still think they're a vibe. So I'm gonna continue to wear my creepers, okay? But this I got in a medium and look at the back. 
you guys. It also has drawstrings underneath to cinch in the waist. So this is a whole look. So next up we have this very holy denim jacket and this is giving me hobo chic, okay? I really like this. I don't have any denim jackets that are super distressed like this. So I thought it was cute. I like it. I like the placement of the distressing. I think it's very well placed, honestly and truly. I love the raw edge at the bottom. I just love it. I don't know how I would style this necessarily, but I do really like this. I'm pretty sure I said this, but I got it in a large and it fits really, really nicely. I think if I had the right denim, like wash of denim, that would be really cute. Like denim on denim. What do you guys think? How would you rock this? If you would even rock it, honestly, because I know some of y'all don't be feeling the pieces that I be showing, but this one's cute. It's different. Y'all let me know because y'all know I love my denim jackets, but this is very different from the ones that I normally pick. So next up we have a button down, a very cropped button down, and this is super cute. I love the colors. I love this material. It's very, very good quality material, and I love how it's cropped. Typically, you guys know I go for my super long line button downs, but this one is a cute cropped one, and it looks really nice with these jeans and this little crop underneath if you wanted to rock it. Very relaxed and chill. You could wear leggings. You could wear sweats, sis, you could do whatever. This I got in a size large and I really like the way it fits. I love the colors. I love the colors of this. This is so freaking cute. So yeah, let's move on to the next piece because sis, this video is already in 40 minutes, girl. So next up we have this really, really cute green, like forest green button down. And before I move on, this thing is so freaking soft, so freaking soft. like. I need this in the form of a blanket because this thing feels so freaking good. But I got this in a size large and I just really loved the color. I have some heels that kind of match this that I got from Shein as well. So I want to see if I could create a look with this and those heels. We shall see. You guys will see if I end up doing it. But I really like this. I love the oversized fit. You guys know this is how I like my button downs to fit. Super oversized like this so this is a vibe so last but certainly not least we have this really cute jacket and this i thought was really unique and different i love the colors in this this i got in a size large and it has a lot going on like as you can see it has the uh elastic not elastic the drawstring at the waist so you can make it a little bit tighter if you want a more shaped look or if you want it to look like this super baggy and oversized you can keep it like this as well but i just really like the, the pop of baby blue is what got me i really like it a lot and this is definitely one of my favorites and it's also the last piece in today's video so comment down below your favorite piece in today's video let's get this video to 5,000 likes girl okay 5,000 likes for your girl for this long ass video and if you guys want to see more Shein videos like this, definitely be sure to get her to 5,000 and I will do that for you. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you all in my next haul or my next video, whatever that is. I love you guys. Bye.